Oh, hey, welcome back, everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Today we are in Napanee, Indiana at Heckman Homes, and we are currently standing outside of the Bridgewood 2. This is a cute ranch style modular home. It is a three bedroom, two bath, 1,680 square foot. And as far as the price goes, this home is approximately $181,000. Now, of course, that price can change due to a whole wide variety of reasons, and it may or may not be the price that you pay if you decide to make this home yours. Just keep that in mind. I'm only here for information, inspiration, and a little bit of entertainment every now and again. That last part, not so much. But with that said, I am not a salesman or affiliated with any of the homes that I show on the channel. We simply travel across the country showing you some of the latest and greatest modular homes. So, Heckman Homes, they have a huge swath that they cover in the northern Midwest. So, I know that there are a lot of you out there. So, this could be the builder for you. Now, they do build their homes right here in Napanee. And I'll leave all that information for you down in the description. So I think this one is super cute. You got a back door back here coming out of your kitchen. Nice little dining room in here as well. You'll see it once we get around there. Now you can also head over to timothyplivingston.com and check out all of the homes that we've toured. We are making it where it's a little bit easier to find the different homes. Uh, you can search them by state. You can search them by uh, floor plans such as bedrooms, square footage how many stories you want, and then Jen does all the write-ups for all the different walkthroughs that we do, and then that links back to the video, so if you find one and you want to go check out the video also, you can do that. So hopefully all of this stuff helps you find that perfect dream home, and this one, I think it's definitely up there. So without further ado, we shall go ahead and work our way inside. All right, so this is another one of those nice floor plans with a, an actual foyer. But this is the view that you were greeted with when you first walk in. And I'll go ahead and turn you around real quick, let you check out the entrance. So this is your front door. And then next to that, you have this nice craftsman style door. They have them throughout the home. You do have a coat closet. And then from there, coming down the foyer, you have a hall to your right, and then that opens up into your living room, dining room, and kitchen area. So we're gonna go ahead and go over here to the right and hit up the bedrooms and utility room real quick. And the first door that you do come to is your utility room. You have your furnace over here to our left, and then you have your washer and dryer hookups. And then behind this door, it's the garage, but this is just a mock garage, so it's not a fully built garage. The door's locked, so can't get into this one. But uh, we did film one here that had a garage that we could go into, so I'll point to that towards the end of this video if you wanna go check that out. It's a great, big, two-story craftsman-style home. So they have three models here in total and it has been fun going through every single one of them. All right, the next room that we come to is your first full bathroom. You have a single vanity in here with your vanity lights, your toilet, and then you have a shower and tub combo. And then out of there, you have your two bedrooms. We'll go ahead and go to the, this one first, all the way at the end of the hall. So this sits towards the back of the home. It is a nice, it's a nice big room too. It's got two great big windows right here. And then look at the closets in these things. Like, I love walking into them when they don't have the step-in closets. I just, it feels more spacious. You can store a few more things in there so your room's not quite as cluttery. And then coming out of there, at the, all the way at the end of the hall, you have a linen closet. 
And across the way, you have your second bedroom. Ooh, that, that whale's pretty cool, though. Pretty neat. But second bedroom right here. This one sits on the side of the house. And it also has a deeper step-in closet. So nice split floor plan. You know, all the secondary bedrooms are on the opposite side of the house from the master bedroom. And then from there, you come into your living room area. Oh, for some reason, I was thinking that sliding door came in from the kitchen. <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> Uh, fun stuff. Anyway, nice size living room in here. And then looking back towards the dining room and kitchen area. So nice size dining room space. Now, as far as all the upgrades and features and stuff, if you love the floor plan, um, you know, you can always swap out if you wanted to run vinyl plank floors throughout this home especially like in the dining room area i think that would be um, a big positive but just keep that in mind just because you see different features in any of the homes that i tour um, you can always turn them into your own you know what i mean i think that's the the main purpose of all of these videos just to give you a gist of what's happening and then, you know, you can explore your thoughts down in the comments and see what others are thinking too. Now this cabinet color, it is gorgeous. I had to look it up real quick. It is called Collins Twilight. So if you were interested in it, if not, <laughs> now it's stated onto interwebs for my own personal bookmark. Nice pantry, and then you have your dishwasher and your sink. All of the counter space kind of wrapping around the kitchen. Very nice. And then, of course, your sink sits right below this window right here. Lazy Susan. Do, 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 do. Big old corner cabinet right here. Gas stove, microwave up above it. Huge drawer right here. And then you have a big old space for your refrigerator. And then off of the kitchen and dining room, you come into your master bedroom. Kind of wraps around over to the left a little bit. But to the right, you have the closet. So great big closet in here. You have attic access also. And then just a very nice, light and airy feeling room. Of course, that has a lot to do with the decorating. The whites and yellows just kind of give it a nice spring touch. And then uh, off of that, you come into your ensuite. Boom, shakalaka. It's got the tub. You have double vanity right here with your vanity lights. Linen cabinet. And then just a nice, fun soaking tub right here. And then back behind us, you do have your toilet and then your shower. You have your shower head and then a couple benches on either side or footrests.
All right, so let me know what you think about this home down in the comments. If you want any more information on this model or Heckman Homes, I'll leave that information for you down in the description. You can also go check it out over at timothyplivingston.com. If you want to check out that cool Craftsman home that I was talking about, go ahead and click on this video right here. And as always, guys, thank you so much for hanging out. My name is Timothy, and I will see your beautiful face in the next one.